Hey guys, this is Sane here, and welcome to another Battlefield 4 video. Today we're going to be going over how my teammates did not trust me at all. Um, so at the at the very beginning right there, I saw some people pushing up uh, as we're defending on Rush on Operation Metro. When you're defending, you don't need to be pushing up like that, so I just simply said, don't push up, defend, for fuck's sake. I um, actually put FFAS, but that's just because I'm a shitty typer. So then some of the people in the lobby started saying, yep, right there, you the boss, Royal. And that really pissed me off. Actually, one of my squad mates actually said copy. I didn't actually notice that when he was um, during the game. But yeah, I always have my caps on, too. I always accidentally hit it, so I normally type in all caps. And so I just said, no, I'm just not an idiot. But today we're going to be going over a little bit of stuff. Um, they're going to see that I am the boss. And as you can see right there, I just noob tube somebody in the face. Not a noob tube, but an RPG. Um, I know the last Operation Metro video I did, I was talking about how you don't need a noob tube. Uh, you don't need the grenade launcher or anything like that to be good in this map. And I still agree with that. This, I accidentally, I was planning on using the SG-553. This is actually one of my favorite guns in the game. I was planning on using that, but as you know, it's a carbine. I was going to use it on the medic class. I forgot to switch it to the medic class, so I spawned in as engineer. And then after that, I was just like, you know what? Fuck it. Might as well see if I can RPG some bitches in the face. And I did. I RPG'd a lot of motherfuckers in the face, and I thought it was hilarious. <laughs> I understand why people, um, uh... Spam. I still would rather get killed with an RPG, I think, than get killed by someone just fucking spamming the, what is it, the LV, the HLV, I think it is, those fucking spam grenades. I think that I would rather see them do that. Um, so now as I kill Ronald Reagan, uh, we're going to see some, some of my mistakes that I made in this game. I'm going to go over it a little bit, talk about what I shouldn't or should have done. Ooh, I'm feeling a sneeze coming. Oh, nope, nope, stay back, stay back. But I was also getting spammed by the Dow a lot, which is actually one of the new second assault shotguns that came out, one of the weapons. It's uh, it's actually pretty damn powerful, and it shoots very quickly. It has a slow reload, but check it out, all these guys on this. They were actually trying to get the flank off, so I knew as I get shot in the face. I knew to cover that area uh, because lots of people they have that little airway to where they can go straight up the stairs and then just come straight back down and then your whole team is flanked because they're right on top of A. We're actually about to lose A right now because all those guys are coming back. I actually ended up taking quite a bit of them out but you know they always spawn and there's more of them and more of them. I try to come up here I actually don't remember if we diffused it this time. I think we did. Nope this isn't when we diffused it but this is actually something one I want to talk about. We don't get the defuse on this one. You'll see a lot of my teammates. They're still running up. They're still trying to get it, um, which is good. Go for the objective. Try to get it defused as much as possible. But as soon as that objective does explode, you need to retreat and go back to the new bases. Base loss, fall back. Do what it says on the screen. Because otherwise, the attackers are going to advance and all your defending team is still going to be up front. And check it out as I take another RPG to the face right here. Ooh, that makes me feel so good. It's so funny when you RPG. I was actually surprised nobody was bitching about it, about me RPGing people in this. I guess they're just so used to Operation Metro, all the explosives. But, um, yep, I, that's what I, um, that's one of my big points in this game that I want to make. When you're defending, you need to be by the MCOMs the whole time. That's actually why I got in an argument with some of the people in my, in, uh, on my team. They were saying that, oh, are you the boss, Royal? Like, no, I'm just fucking playing how I'm supposed to be playing. Throwing some nades in there, trying to defend as I get tried to be sniped. Like, no, no fucking way, not today. So the SG-553, I'm going to be doing a review on this gun as well as I see that guy going through the wall. I'm actually going to look at this glass. I should be able to fucking go through right there. I don't know what's up with that. My fucking LMG person was sitting there like a pussy. I just run in and kill him. I knew he was there. But SG-553, it's actually the gun that I have the most kills with. I think I have over 800, 900 kills with this gun. With Battlefield 4, I do try to... Um, to change it up, I try to use a lot of different guns, but check this out right here. I know I keep changing my what I'm talking about. Those little fire extinguishers, I actually did not know that you could do that. I saw it there and I was like, you know what, fuck it, I might as well try it. So I exploded. So that's actually a pretty cool little way, especially if you're trying to defuse it or you're trying to plant it even. 
Uh, if you don't have any smoke bombs or anything, not smoke bombs, fucking smoke grenades, you can shoot that off and then you got a like, nice little cover. Unless you got that big ass orange Dorito over your head. This guy, I knew that I was, um, that that guy was in there. That's why I actually turned around to shoot at him. But he came around the corner, uh, he came around the corner with guns blazing. So there wasn't really too much that I could do about that. So, I, uh, I try to always go for the objective, even if it's, um, even if it's a death situation like that was. I mean, you still want to play it smart. You don't want to be wasting... Well, actually, as defenders, you don't want to be wasting... T you're not going to be wasting tickets, but... I still always try to go to the objective. Try to defuse it. Uh, that was... I didn't see any of my other teammates going, so I figured that if I could at least defuse it fast enough before he came around that corner, but... I wasn't able to do it. Here, I'm actually going to try my little Jew tactic to actually get another RPG kill, but it doesn't happen. As I meet my maker. Nope, not right there. It's coming now. It's always coming. Nope, I got more RPGs. <laughs> Shooting more people in the face. Okay, I thought that was a different part. But <laughs> it's really, really fucking hilarious, at least to me, to just hit someone across the map with an RPG in their face. I don't know what you guys think about that, but... Yeah, the SG-553, it's got a pretty good accuracy at long range. Uh, pretty ridiculous, I'd have to say. But here we go, latched its effort to defuse the objective as they try to rush in as their tickets are diminishing. But I got to defuse as I get shot in the face by a fucking Dow. Took me out, look at that. He took out like four guys right there with that Dow shotgun. But, you know what, that's what happens, shotguns are in the game, you gotta play around them. Alright guys, I hope you enjoyed this video of me just pretty much rambling over some gameplay. If you did, don't forget to hit that like button. Oh, you see that? Guess I was a good boss. Hold on, I gotta say this. Wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. Yes! The bitches admit that I was good. They should have listened to me in the first place. Be sure to check us out in the next one, guys. And I will see you there.